Hi, I'm Yolanda Smiley. I work here at the Women's Circle for 10 years. I just started managing. So tell us, how did the idea to turn the restaurant into McDowell's come together? Actually, it was the new owners. They were sitting in the office. And they actually got it together like one day and put all of this together. Have they done this in the past? No, this would be the first time in 33 years. What are the major changes to the menu? The only change we had was putting on the uh, Big Mac. So tell us, what's in a Big Mac? Uh, it's the all beef patties with our special sauce, onion, lettuce, and pickles on a seedless bun. Would you say that was the number one seller this Halloween? That was the number one seller. Yes, it was. How did the switch impact the amount of customers you guys received? It actually improved it. Um, we, we're, right about now is like our slow peak. So them doing this like really put a big impact on our business. Was there a line out the door? Yes, we had a line out the door from Friday, Saturday and today, you know, so the business is great. Has anyone from the movie contacted the restaurant? Uh, I hear Eddie Murphy, he put a shout out on Facebook. You guys are known for verbally harassing each other and customers. Has there ever been a time where the customer wasn't really in on the joke? Yeah, it's a lot of our customers are not aware of the rudeness and their reaction to it is like unbelievable sometimes. They turn red, they walk out and you know, they're just not used to it. And then we'll run out and tell them, oh, it's just a part of our job. So can you explain the chocolate shake order? The chocolate shake has been going on for probably past my time. And they walk up, ask for a chocolate shake, one of our girls in the back, 20 bucks, and they do a song, music, flashlights, and shake. Are you guys gonna dress up as a different movie next year? Absolutely, as we speak, they're working on something now um, for Valentine's Day, and I'm quite sure Next year, we got to come up with something else to come check us out 24 7 to come see us. He tried as much as he could, but he couldn't make it. But we pretty much knew that it was a slim chance that he was going to make it in the short time that we made this project. So we just kept moving, and it's us four on there. A heterosexual man doesn't mind planting seeds of being gay in your mind of himself just in order to propel himself with popularity and money. Do you know who does this? In this society. Do you know who else does this? Who? Daylight. Ah.